right, the first step for making our dragon is we're gonna make the big eye right in the middle. And that is basically gonna be a football shape. And we want it to be pretty big on our paper. You don't just want some tiny little eye because dragons are huge. So our big eye, I'm gonna start with the top of it and it's gonna be um, like a rainbow line. So I'm gonna go up and over, kind of stretched out rainbow. Make that a little darker. Okay, and then you're gonna do the same thing on the bottom, just going the opposite direction. So it's like a stretched out U shape. Boom. Now we need the eyelid, and the eyelid is just gonna be a thin line that follows the same top curve. So I'm gonna start in the middle there, thin line, boom. There's that creepy eyelid. And now the eye is my favorite part. We're going to start in the middle, the top of this eyelid, and we're gonna make a stretched out C shape. So it's like a C, but it's really stretched out. And then reverse it, do the same on the other side, a backwards C. So it kind of makes this cool looking oval. I guess it's just an upside down or like a sideways football. It's the same as the eyeball, just smaller and sideways. Um, okay, now for the details of the scales, we are going to make a line that starts over on the edge of our paper. It's going to go straight toward the eye, and then it's gonna go up and around, down, straight toward the edge. So, watch this. Toward the eye, up and around, and over. Boom. Then we're gonna do the same thing up above it. Another line that goes up and around and over. And then up above one more time. Up and around. I kind of run out of paper space, so I'm just gonna do an imaginary, pretend like the line is going up here and around. Continue down, boom. Then we need to do the same thing on the bottom. So I'm gonna start my sideways line here and go down and around and over, down and around and over, and one more, down and around, imaginary, and over. Okay, so that's the basic shape of our eye. Now we need to make some scale patterns in here, and you can kind of choose, you could do circles, you could do triangly zigzags, or you could do like little squares. Um, I'm gonna do some triangle zigzags on this one. So I'm gonna go just like this, some zigzags all the way across. You could even change up the pattern. So you could do zigzags on your first row. Maybe your next row could be circles. Dragon scales are crazy and different. So I, I feel like you could have whatever kinds of dragon scale patterns you want. And then we could just do little oops, squiggly lines to kind of look like squares. Boom. So you just want to fill up your whole paper with those scales. And now we are ready to paint and add the color. That's where the magic's gonna happen and it's gonna start to look really awesome.